Who do you say that I am? A 40-day adventure in God. Day 26. The King of Glory. Psalm 24 verse 7. Lift up your heads, O you gates. Be lifted up, you ancient doors, that the King of Glory may come in. Revelation 5 21. In a loud voice they sang, Worthy is the Lamb who was slain to receive power and wealth and wisdom and strength and honour and glory and power. Isaiah 42 verse 8. I am the Lord, that is my name. I will not give my glory to another or my praise to idols. 2 Corinthians 4.4 4. The God of this age has blinded their minds of unbelievers, so they cannot see the light of the gospel of the glory of Christ, who is the image of God. And 1 Peter 4.14 4. If you are insulted because of the name of Christ, you are blessed, for the spirit of glory and of God rests upon you. The King of Glory. Glory, that amazing word we use so often, we sing about his glory. When Moses was on the mountain and he said, Lord, almost show me your face. And God said, I can't show you my face. But I'll pass by and in the last part you'll see my glory. On the tabernacle. The glory of God came down, the amazing presence. It came down like a cloud and like a light. And it came in and overwhelmed the place, so much so that the people could not do anything else. The ministers couldn't minister. They were flat on their faces. Because when we witness God's glory, when we witness his presence, it overwhelms us. We recognize that we have no power we have nothing. We are little feeble things. But God has chosen to put his glory in us. He displayed his glory. He manifest his glory through Jesus. And that glory is in us. Because Christ in us is the hope of glory. His Holy Spirit within us is the dwelling of his glory. And when we are together, when his presence is amongst us, when the presence within is coupled with the presence of a gathered church, his glory is there. And his glory is to fill the whole earth as the waters cover the sea. We see those gates opened up. We see the conquering mighty king coming in. And he is filling that place with his glory. The beauty of the name, the king of glory, where he rules in glory. The nature of his name. We're so privileged to be part of what he is and what he is doing. He is the king of glory.